and I'll leave home without the passport. Hi travellers, I'm Anne's daughter Lalika. Welcome to my room here at Crystal's house in Johannesburg, South Africa. So, we're going to Kruger, yes! For three nights, four days. So what am I packing? First and most importantly, my passport. We are self-driving. I am only going to take my wheelie suitcase, my carry-on behind me here. My it's luggage. We are actually staying outside of Kruger now. I'm sure a forthcoming video will show you about some of our adventures in Kruger, so please consider subscribing. As I post new videos every week giving tips and strategies that may help enhance your travel experiences. So I'm well excited because I haven't been to Kruger since. Gee, I have to think about that. I've been once. <laughs> and. It's a very large park, so perhaps where we're going is not the same place where you might be going because it is such a large chunk of land. But be sure to stay tuned and I'll link the videos in the description box below of our fun times there. Last time I stayed in Kruger, it was definitely before my channel because I haven't even been to South Africa since I started my YouTube channel, which is even more exciting to be back. It's a little bit warmer in Kruger than it is Joburg. It's definitely the last time I went to Kruger I did self-drive. I just hired a car from Joburg Airport and then drove it out. Well, I actually did a whole road trip around South Africa, which was so much fun. Like, I would love to do that again. However, not this time. I literally hired just a wee car because I'm terrible with parking. <laughs> I did get my international license before I left New Zealand for Kuwait. Yeah, I don't know if I necessarily need it. Maybe I could just drive on my license as is. That I'm actually not sure about. We also did buy a safari, so like the early morning one, and I think we did an evening one too for memory, that we paid additionally for. And then you get to go out in the trucks with the actual trackers, and you know, because they talk to each other, then there's just a much better chance of animal spotting. So I would also recommend that, but you can totally self-drive. I'm really hoping to see a leopard. And if you've seen my videos of Sri Lanka, if you've been following along, then you'll know that I didn't see a leopard in Sri Lanka, but I'm quite disappointed about, so I really need one here. <laughs> so I'll definitely be taking singlets and stuff for during the day, but also because we'll be sitting in a car with aircon on, and I get quite cold, so I will definitely be taking like my best. But you know, you want to get along with the other people in your vehicle, and if they prefer a blasting aircon, and I feel like that's the Arctic, then I have to dress accordingly. Just single it short. This is my current handbag. Cute, hey? When you're out shopping, like you have to pay for plastic bags like you do at home. So I found this to be super handy. It just has my wallet, lip balm, and top. Bathroom bag, which basically has everything in it. But there's a few extras I'm going to check in too. This is for cords and things, charges, a wear bag. I said four days, three nights. There's a few things that I want to take bathroom bag wise that I still need for my shower in the morning before we go. So I will actually make a little list of like face moisturizer, body moisturizer to remind myself tomorrow morning I need to chuck this in before we leave. PJs. Okay, so that's one, two, three. I'll be taking sunscreen too. Definitely shoving in the bottom. This is long sleeve black top. It's a pretty standard affair. Now usually I employ the KonMari method of folding as you've seen with my other packing videos. But because this is an unstructured packing cube and I don't like it, ah, Jeans are out. Yippee! Alright, let's zip it up. Now, weight is not an issue because we are driving. Yippee! And I just want it all to just jam in. Yeah. So, when I arrive, first thing is the PJs on top, which is great. Should have taken after the same amount of room. We're ready to go. Four days, three nights. Looking good. Now, what am I wearing in the car tomorrow? I am almost Kruger ready. Yes, yes, yes. Let's go. All right, it is the morning of. It is 
5.40 a.m. <laughs> Showered, dressed. Just throwing the last things in. I'm about to wear. I am taking a blanket to combat the aircon, and we're ready to go. Kruger, Kruger, Kruger.